Um, Secret Order 2, just about finished installing. Looks like it's finished installing now. Um, let's see. Games, Secret Order 2, play. Is it starting? I think it's starting. This one does have achievements, so good good news for you, Stephanie. <laughs> Yay! You know how much you love achievements. <laughs> Where could they possibly go with the sequel? I mean, you went back in time, you stopped the Dragon Mafia. I guess we didn't go back in time to a point where the Secret Order didn't exist. We actually went back in time and saved the Secret Order from being destroyed. So they can continue to do things that they weren't able to do in the last timeline. Right? Because the members of the Secret Order died in the fire, except we saved them from not dying. Yes. So now they can get into up to all sorts of hijinks. That's probably all fine. I think we want advanced. Yeah. Active zones not indicated, but hidden objects seen sparkle. Yeah, I don't know what they mean exactly by active zones, but whatever. The important thing is the hidden object should sparkle. For centuries. The secret order of the Griffins has protected all of us. They quietly keep the balance between peace and chaos. Today, the order has initiated Nathan Williams, their youngest ever member. As Nathan gazes at the picture of his late parents, his heart is suddenly filled with an unforgotten hunger for vengeance. With his new ring, he is able to open the Order's central safe, where closely guarded artifacts are concealed. The moment he puts on the mask, vengeance is unleashed. Such a dragon mafia. Oh, it must be. I have a feeling mask is a pun here. Masked mask. New objective answer the phone. Also, I accidentally minimized my Twitch chat, so I'm expanding it again. Where was I? Here we go. I'm answering the phone. Your father, you have to help us. Nathan betrayed us. He took the mask. His eyes. Listen carefully. Find the brooch in the hall. Then get to the Naval Museum. My old friend Christopher is the curator. The museum has an extensive security system, but there's a secret way in. Look for signs from legends. Find Christopher. He'll help you. But be careful, Sarah. Nathan will come after you. Oh no. He's here. This is an old cell phone. That is a really old cell phone. Like from a guardhouse, almost. So we are Sarah again. Well, I mean, every protagonist is named Sarah, so we don't know for sure <laughs> if it's the same Sarah or not. That's a good point. We have to find the brooch, and then legends will show us the way. Something right. like that. How to get into the museum. Is this the brooch? Yeah, it could be. These gems are small. I need the right tools to remove them. How many freaking gems do I have just lying around my house that I need all tools to remove? At least two. I thought you said they're in the hall. There's one. I'm interested in that hat. Is that hat movable? Interesting. So 
Some gems are missing. I guess we need four. This man founded the Naval Museum. Dad used to talk about them a lot. Could you imagine growing up with like a bust in your house <laughs> that Dad talks about? Oh, my family, those were good times. <laughs> oh wait, I don't have the brooch. I think people say brooch. Brooch. Why would they put two O's or as a brooch? That's a good question. Where did I have the, the thing that was locked? Um, Here? Yeah. What the heck is that? Is that a gem removal tool? Jeweler tool, yeah. <laughs> Why, yes it is. Wow. There's one on that yeah, book there. Oops. On the picture frame, I think. This? Oh, here's one. I feel like the next there's one more in the next room, like at the the bottom of the bust or something like that. Oh no, that's where we placed them. But the, it's over here. Yeah, this is weird. Why would I keep the key after I finish unlocking the thing? One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So that sounds good. Oh, it went the other way. <laughs> Oops. I might be fucked here. Back to? Oh, you can go back. That's handy. We got lucky. Oh, we got an achievement! Yeah. We're already doing better than the last game where we got zero achievements. This is my family's prize brooch. Hidden well, Dad. Hidden well. <laughs> that is a tone you don't hear that often in the hidden object games. Well played, Dad. Nice. <laughs> what was that? Was it Nathan? My father said he's coming. Wow, that is a big nautical museum. <laughs> what happened to Griffin headquarters? My father was in there. I have to find Christopher and figure out what's going on. Christopher is the guy who's going to help us? Who knows. Okay. It's sword shaped. <laughs> Good point. But a nightmare must be for everyone inside. Maybe they're just having a barbecue. If a part of the bezel is missing this thing? No, that's a rag. Puzzle piece. I need something solid and sharp to remove the stone. Why would I want to remove the stone? There's a puzzle piece there in that bush. And something solid and sharp, maybe? No. Nope. Help. Help. Camping lamp. Does it show us the thing? I don't think so. So they removed that feature. Oh. This thing, maybe? Could be. Trowel. Is that a small shovel? Um, yes. This? Sure. Adhesive tape. It's because they can't say scotch tape? I don't know that we can say that. 
I, I, um, they were one of my sponsors. <laughs> um, on the bottom, that yellow. S this? Yeah, maybe. That was nope, twine, was obviously. Twine. What about that black tape in front of the bucket to your left? Yeah, that. Oh, well, a folding ruler. You're on it, yeah. Well, a level. Yep. What about a tape measure? Sure. What about a hose nozzle? I'm so far away that I thought that said horse nozzle. How about a horse nozzle? Sounds amazing. Yeah, that's a. How about a spade? Yeah, it's more I like a that's... shovel. No, the spade is up on the wall. Um, up. Yeah, there you go. Oh, apparently it's not. Apparently no, it's that shovel. It's that shovel. Okay. Now a bird. Why would they put a spade in the picture? And it's not, <laughs> it's not that, it's a shovel. Right. Welcome pumpkin pirate, by the way, horse nozzle. <laughs> what is that emote? I've never seen that before. Is that a drunken squirrel? Can I mouse over? Fidgasm. Okay. <laughs> nice. Do you see a bird, pumpkin pirate? Wow. Because I'm not seeing a bird. Oh, uh, it's on top. Uh, it's uh, okay. So it's two. It's in the bushes. Oh, the I see. Yeah. It, yeah. Wow, a hedge cutter. There it is. You found it. Oh, a swan. The swan would be hidden somewhere. Was that the bucket? Wait, where? I had the hand icon somewhere here. Oh, on this? No, maybe. This? Yeah. God. We found Gosh, it. Gosh darn it! <laughs> found the swan. Useful object swan. <laughs> Nope, hedge clippers. We got another achievement! Independent. I like don't we need, didn't get a hint, maybe? I don't need no man to tell me what to do. I thought it would be those bushes, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, these. Oh, here we go. Nope, that's... Well, I guess I can stick this here. I'm, I'm looking for some hedges to, to clip. But, uh... It did say we need something solid and sharp. When, when did it say that? Here? Mm -mm. On the Oh, on the fountain. stone? Like to cut the stone? Maybe. I'm talking about this, I think. Mm -hmm. I need something solid and sharp to remove the stone. Yeah. Do hedge clippers count as solid and sharp? <laughs> I feel like you cannot remove stone with a hedge clippers. Please work. Pretty please find me that way. Wow. Sarcasm. Nice. The images on those banners remind me of a story. Thousands of years ago, the tiny kingdom of Aerial rose from obscurity to the heights of power. In just a few decades, they created the biggest empire in history. Their greatest king, Amadon, ruled for more than two lifetimes. According to legend, he drew his power from two artifacts, a scepter, and a mask. That's the whole story. <laughs> I feel like we might hear more of the story later. The replicas of both artifacts are exhibited in the museum. Oh, this is a mask and this is a staff, I guess. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Find some hedges Finally to clip. Finally a hedge. Oh, he wants a sword, probably. Like, we have to build a sword at the air place. And then bring it here, maybe. What's in that can that we have? This? Oil. Okay. It's just like Dad said, the security's been activated so I can't get in this way. That's a weird way to activate the security. Like, they don't have the gate down most of the time, but if you get near, that's when the gate goes down. Look, they broke one of the oh. things. 
Maybe we can use it for our sword. Yeah, it'd be a weird sword though. Like it would have a sword handle but then a spear tip. Bezo, where would we need the bezel? There was something there was some word that said her bezel like was that the statue that it's missing the bezel? You're right. If only I were paying attention. It's such a specific word. My family's brooch fits inside this inset. That's helpful because I would not have thought to do that. Yeah. Oh crap. It's gonna fall on our head. Do I need the two side things? I guess so. Hilt, I guess it's called. Looks like we have all the pieces of the puzzle. Oh, when did that happen? I don't remember picking up the fifth piece. You finally got the fifth element. I feel like that crown piece you have, yeah, connects. There, yep. Yeah. Oh, that's connected? I thought that was wrong, so I tried to rotate some more. Oops. Do they have con competitive jigsaw puzzling? Probably. Is that a thing? That yeah, probably exists. Pommel for the sword, I guess. But I still don't know where the two hilt things would be. What part of the sword is the pommel? This part. Spearhead. I guess we could try. Being. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. They've upped their, uh, their sass. So what else can we try? What can we light on fire? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Wait, can can we use that the arrow to remove the stone? Oh, good idea. I did not think of that. Look at that sword hilts. Or one big hilt, I guess. Sword guard is what this guy calls it. <laughs> this guy. The guy who wrote this game. This guy. The one person. Did we consult the legends? Is that how that worked? Remember we were supposed to yeah. look for legends? Aphrodite, maybe, or something? <laughs> I guess. Yeah, yeah, that's weird. Some legends were consulted. This guy looks angry. Is that Nathan? Is he coming to kill us? He might be. Can't see my hand in front of my face. Can we Need find a, a lantern? Guy, yes. Oh. Oh no. This was supposed to be a stealth mission. Why? This is a weird museum. It's supposed to be a nautical museum, but it seems to be full of. What do you want? Get out of here. I hope that's oh, Christopher. That you, sir? you might not remember me. We met when you were little. 
So Nathan has taken the mask and awakened the evil forces. I'm afraid we're in big trouble. There was a scepter, the mask's other half, so to speak. Together, the artifacts kept each other in balance. But the last person who really knew anything about the scepter was a wayfarer. And I believe he was executed in the 17th century. Oh, I told your father not to trust Nathan. I had a feeling something like this would happen. Here's a letter I wrote to him. It was returned, unread. You want to read it? Dear Gordon, <laughs> it seems like such a long time since we last spoke. I miss our boisterous conversations, but I know your duties as head of the Secret Five <laughs> keep you overwhelmed with responsibilities, including the upcoming initiation of Nathan Williams. I don't trust him, Gordon. As you know, I believe that nothing happens by chance. I think Nathan is connected to what happened to the Secret Five last month. We are all still mourning the death of Linus, and I am truly thankful that the rest of you survived. However, it seems too convenient that Nathan just happened to be in that place at that time and managed to save only four of you. Now he is about to fill the empty spot. I'm convinced that nothing about that day was an accident. Please meet with me before the ceremony so we can discuss this. Your friend, Christopher. I love when, when groups have names like the Secret if Five. You gain access to tools with enormous power. There is a hollow behind the display cabinet to my left with a similar shape. I'm curious to see what happens if you use the brooch. Did you hear how he pronounced it? Just FYI. Yeah. Completely well, wrong. Yeah, and also I thought he owns this museum, but he doesn't know what happens if I stick the brooch. So. Also, he's in a wheelchair, and there's stairs. Maybe he recently acquired the museum. Hmm. It would be easier to- why are- what are we moving? This oh. display case. He said there's something behind the display case. How much did you think the oil and lighter were for lighting up an oil lamp? Somewhat. Especially when we, when we were in the room and it was right. dark. Yeah. But I did not expect that it was going to be for this. <laughs> I did not anticipate. I have no idea what he's talking about when he said, like, to my left, there's a, like, he, this is not, oh, his left, yeah, okay, so now it's starting to make sense. Okay. A screwdriver would be divine. I might be able to use this somehow. Rope with hook. What would dad do in a situation like this? <clears throat> so I guess we need to find some tokens or something like that. Even as a scout said, wow, it's like majestic. That would be a strange mouth for a whale. <clears throat> That's too high for me. I need something to step on. Wherever the griffins are, this sign seems to appear. What sign? I don't understand what sign that is. I think there, like, when we can see it, there might be a sign that we'll... Not recognize? Yeah. I think that's what's gonna happen. Can you try lassoing the, um, one knight in sharing armor? I guess not. What if we use the knife somewhere in the boat? as a screwdriver. And then our time period that would have worked. Like a time period when you- Oh, I did something. 
Because of the harpoon or something? Yeah. Yeah. Why do I need a harpoon? Can you use it to step on? That's a pretty obtuse way of using a harpoon. <laughs> well, the lantern. Can I combine items? Probably not. Still can't combine items. Can you hook the rope to... You see that part that looks kind of almost laddery? No? Okay. I wanna go back to the dark room though, because we have a lantern now. I wanna go back there. Oh, dark room, here we go. Oh, it's literally called dark room. Oh no! Grandma telling me about the scepter and the mask. What happened? Several oh, hundred years ago, it was loading. An ancient scroll surfaced, and the details it contained led a Griffin research team to Amadon's tomb. Although they secured the mask and the scepter on the royal Griffin, a few days later, a thief stole the scepter. I like that the sound effects are just some guy going psh -oh, psh -oh. I don't think it was some guy. I really? think they actually made or bought for your royalty free <laughs> sound effects somewhere. <laughs> what is this? A carrot? What? It's the handle of a hammer. I thought oh. it was a carrot. Oh. And we got a ladder. Anything else here? We can mess around with this thing somehow. Three holes. Hmm. hmm. Does the brooch thingy fit in there? In another, another time, time period. period. Wait, actually, what about this thing? It's nothing, it's just decoration. Do you remember when he said the last person who knew about it was a wayfarer? From the 17th century? Like, that's a weird. And all these specific. Like, Wayfarer means traveler, right? Yeah. This is like an odd thing to say, isn't it? The last person who knew about it. Like a vagabond, I guess, is what he means by that. That's, that's weird. Oh, I see. There's a guy drowning over here. Oh, we have to redo the order. Oh, yeah. Okay, before we go to that secret room, though. Actually, no, let's just go to the secret room. Oh, we got the ladder for the ship. Yeah. We need a grappling hook. There's a lot of things in this room. One of which is a grappling hook. Oh. And that's what we have to find. That will be useful that it's in here. I'm not seeing the grappling hook. <laughs> Too bad they took out the thing where you can hover over the object and see what, it what do like, they yeah. think a grappling hook yeah. is. <laughs> like you could test them. Yeah. Because it's not always what you expect. You know, like if they're saying, well, you know, sometimes if a wrestler was missing a hand, 
This would be his grappling hook. <laughs> oh, yikes. Oh, um, so on the book, sh on the shelf, um, on the right hand side of the shelf underneath the colorful bowl. Barometer. Or a barometer. On the wall? It's a lot of wall here. Next to the picture of George Washington? This? Yeah. That's way bigger than I thought the barometers were. There's some dolphins underneath the harpoon gun. Like I thought the barometer was about the same size as a thermometer. I think a barometer is like a clock, like you could have any. I thought size. it was a pressure sensing thing. Right. Oh, it, you mean it's like a clock in that you could have. It it measures changes in barometric pressure, but it can yeah, be but like many I, sizes. I thought like theoretically you can have a thermometer in many sizes, right? But like I'm, but the thermometer that were that that was that size would be like a novelty weird joke thermometer, right? Not a normal. That's why it was so easy to see the barometer. <laughs> it was a novelty weird size. Ring. That's it. We have to find the ring. Do they mean like a ring you would wear on your finger, or that's my interpretation? Because that's going to be small. You might unless have to find that unless it's a giant novelty-sized <laughs> ring. What if we came back to that one? You saying you can find a chessboard? Yes. Yeah. A handgun? Bar. This thing? Yeah, it could be that thing. It's not. But it could be. Yeah, but it's not. Is this a ring? Why is it so difficult? I don't know. I mean, I guess nope. they've done a good job of hiding their objects, which is pretty amazing. But I think this drawing. That thing you found is the crowbar. Try clicking on it better. This? Yeah. It was the whole time. The flag is in the. Yeah. The pirate hook is being used by the grappler temporarily. The propeller is on the top shelf behind the colorful bowl. The gauntlet, I think, is two shell, three shelves down. One, two, yeah, that thing. Um, I can find the letter P, so I'm assuming we're making the letter R with that white crayon that you just went over. And the letter P is on the, yeah. So where's the ring? That's the one you were in charge of. I thought you were looking for it. 
Whoa, the music just got really spooky. What if we just click on vague, vaguely circular things? Oh. Was that our penalty? Yeah. Oh, we can also do Mahjong. Oh, okay. You wanna do Mahjong? <laughs> no, I wanna find the stupid ring. What about people who don't like finding <laughs> hidden objects? In hidden object games? Yeah. Yeah. What about that green thing? Is that like a model of a planet in any way with rings around it or something? Can any of our viewers help us out? That was it, I found it. Perfect job. Wait, what did I do? You opened up the new objective. I didn't get to see what it was. The Royal Griffin, 1648. The Royal Griffin was operated by sailors for centuries as they protected humanity across the globe. According to official records, the Royal Griffin was destroyed after its withdrawal from service. In fact, it was hidden in the Naval Museum. The Royal Griffin allows its passengers to disembark at any time in history. I'm not sure I understand what the Royal Griffin is. It's a boat. No, like... It's hidden. Yeah. You think the in, boat is hidden? In the museum, and it's a time boat. You don't. <laughs> it's literally. That's. Look. There's a picture of the boat. It's operated by sailors. And it was operated for centuries? It's a time boat. It moves like, through time. Like, yeah. Oh. Oh. So it was. It, it didn't. So, like, it has a year of 1648, but it wasn't, like, invented in the 1400s before they had that type of sailing vessel. It just operated for centuries by virtue of being a time boat. Yeah. Fantastic. I'm sorry that I'm not up on my <laughs> hidden. I gotta read the objectives because I didn't get to see what it was. Find the Royal Griffin and locate the navigation panel on board. It just said the Royal Griffin can take me to the 17th century. Why would we want to do that? I don't know. Okay. Probably to. so that we can have more time travel happen in this game. Okay. Sounds good. Where will we have to find 17th century objects? I mean, we already are a lot of the time. Griffin is hidden somewhere inside the museum? So the time machine isn't just a legend. You mean time boat, I sir? I can't go running around looking for a frigate. I wait here, and you go find something that leads to the time machine. But hurry, Sarah. Nathan could pounce at any moment. First, do some of my laundry. <laughs> that fucking guy. So what is it that I want needed that it was too high for me to reach this thing? Looks like a keyhole doesn't look like a keyhole to me. Thank goodness she was there to tell you. Wow, we're still keeping the key. Yeah, you never know, right? Could come in handy. For other exact copies of that lock? Yeah. Okay. I still is it is this just a griffin? Yeah. So when they say this this symbol. Alright. A big cogwheel is missing. Is this kinda like a cogwheel? Another, another time period that would have been a cogwheel. A tiny cogwheel is missing. Where would I find any of these things? Crowbar, rub with hook. Where why do why or where do I need that? Oh, it's gonna pull the whale down. Yeah. Oop. 
Oh, maybe this is the turn them all on thing. Is that the big one or the tiny one? That's a tiny one. Obviously. Yeah. Even I could tell. It's not like a joke novelty weird <laughs> size cogwheel. <laughs> I guess we'll stick the tiny one in. Okay. Is that good? Three holes. Hmm. What the hell is this thing? Socket upper part. <laughs> Look at how much bigger that one is. Looks about the same size to me. No, one is big and one was tiny. How come this one's more complicated? To test your skill. Can I even go through that twice? I can't. I think you have to use that big um, loop to the right there. No, no. The uh, bottom right. Don't you think? I don't know what I did, but it solved it. Good job! Is that the hidden time ship? This game really likes to let you keep your objects. Yeah. Wow, drama. We got another achievement. This is a royal griffin that really exists. Was that a rope with a magnet on it? Like, what the hell was that? I think it was a rope with a hook on it. Yeah, but you see how it twirled? Yes. And... That was super convenient for Christopher. Yep. Yeah. Should I talk to him or he's just. <laughs> he just came to observe? He's curious. It, it was. This was before the day of uh, live streaming. To watch people search for hidden objects in person. <laughs> He's coming with us, I guess, back in time. <laughs> that is fantastic. Navigation panel. Find the Royal Griffin, look at the navigation panel on board. Okay, done. Good job. Uh, the Royal Griffin's ability to take voyagers to any time period in history has been a closely guarded secret. 
Based on several first-hand reports of this closely guarded secret, Griffin leaders <laughs> deemed it too dangerous for most people to handle. However, the decision was made to hide the Griffin rather than destroy it, as the Order must retain the ability to revisit past events in emergency situations. As an added precaution, we've hidden the navigation instruments, the time stone, the sextant, and the compass. May luck accompany you on your path. a contemporary announcement with the exact date of the execution. What does that say on the bottom? Pom Pontus Goo? Or Tam Pontres God. I don't know. Or Goo. Wow. I think this is the Yield. What is it called? So it's Torn? Oh, um, the TH? Yeah. Alright, handy to know about. Weren't we supposed to do something with the whale? Yeah, I mean, I don't know yet. I'm gonna try a bunch of things in that. Because we're missing like a crank or something, so we got like a whole bunch of things that might be it, but apparently it's that one. The one that said crank on it? Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Wow. Glad he was downstairs and not up here. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, it says. Okay. Hopefully that's a time stone. Yeah, this was the can, other one. Okay. I think you can click on it to find out, or like hover over it to see what it is, yeah. Yeah, but I want to build up the suspense. Oh, the suspense. Horse head. Horse nozzle. <laughs> yeah, find the horse nozzle. I'm not seeing any horse nozzles. I want them to bring back the... Like, what the hell are you talking about? Yeah, that button. Feature. That feature. How about a rapier? Uh, in the gun rack? That might be a katana. Yeah. It's a katana. How about this thing? Oh, that might like, be a foil? Like yeah, a that could foil. be a rapier. It was. I'll buckle this thing. Okay. Portal. Yeah. Shield. This? Oh, right. I'll buy that. Binoculars. Ain't no nozzle like a horse nozzle. That's such a good point. <laughs> Except no substitutes. <laughs> I think the binoculars are in the cobwebs under the um, harpoon gun. But I would be wrong. Have you ever seen Flight of the Concords? I think I've seen a couple episodes. Did you ever see the one where they did, ain't no party like my grandma's tea party? Oh, that was a lamp. That was not clear. I don't think I've seen that episode, no. <laughs> oh, it's good stuff. It's gotta be this, though. I didn't get it. Click on it better.
Maybe that, um, okay, do you see the red thing on the second shelf down on the right? Is that? Halberg. Bird. Oh, that's right. I gotta know my medieval weaponry to play hidden yeah. object games. Yes. Don't be confusing a katana for a rapier. Uh, I think the arrow is in the harpoon gun. The rook. Yeah. And now our old friend, the horse nozzle. <laughs> this thing? Oh, there's something I can pick up here. Nope. Oh, eight lamps. Wow. There's like 16 on the shelves. Yeah, that one. That green one above. That one. Maybe that thing that you're right next to? No, that, that, that thing? There's a bell. I oh, think. okay, then there's one right there. Oh, the, there's another one on the um, wooden shelves. Up. Oh. Yes. No. What? And then um, it's down. It's like a vase or something. Uh, right, yeah, to your left, yeah. Okay, but where's the horse head? What is even locked? Maybe that chest? Try clicking on the chest with the key. Try clicking on the desk with the key. Try clicking better on the chest with the key. So not here, but here. Right. It's very specific about where it wants you to click. Where is the horse head? What's that black thing on the wooden shelves? How about the one behind it? This is a tricorn hat. We're gonna get invaded by Nathan soon. Yeah, there he is. How about that white thing behind where the harpoon gun used to be? I feel like I click on every object. I can't see, but is there any like drawings on the wall that look like horses? I'm not seeing any drawings on the wall. Except for this girly thing. Well, like it looks like there's maybe some sort of stain or something next to the portrait. Here? Where are you uh, going next up to? a little bit. Okay, to the right. That thing? Like, do you see any more things like that? Oh! Oh! See that metal thing? Um, the metal... Uh, that's not very helpful. The... the, the okay, go uh, to... Same latitude that you're at, go to your left. Is latitude up down? Uh, left, right. Latitude is left, right? Uh, no, uh, latitude is, uh, yeah, up down. So stay right there. Uh, stop. Stop. Uh, go half an inch to the right. Go up half an inch. Oh, I that see. That thing. Gosh darn it. Horse nozzle! Apparently we were quick. Finger. <laughs> We got an anti-achievement. This game is sarcastic. We did Yay! it. Hooray. Thank you. That's the sense of joy that I am also feeling. <laughs> it's not quite what I'm feeling, but <laughs> <laughs> we'll move on, I guess. <laughs> Wait, now I think I have all my stuff, so now I just go to the, the, the time ship. 
Like he's stuck there. Wait, what was that? How did I go back? Oh, it's just a flag. Yeah, it's weird because it looks like it's something stuck in the... In the rock. Yeah. In the wall of the cave. Oh, wait, what do I need for this? The time stone, maybe? No, the time stone's for the, um... For the navigation table. I guess I need a key that I don't have yet. Did you try your other key? I tried this and I tried the, okay. my two eternal keys that I keep hanging on to. Alright. But yeah, so three ingredients. Time stone. No, time stone. Compass. And sextant. Oh no, Nathan's caught up to me. Too bad. As long as I can get 21.1 gigawatts on the ship, we should be able to escape. I hope we're taking um, some citrus fruit back with us, because we are definitely headed back to the time of scurvy. The scurvy contagious or something? I uh, was like, as long as I ate vitamin C, you know, in a reasonable time in the present, I'll be okay for a while. Right, but you're gonna go back to when it's not the present. Yeah, but I'm like, don't doesn't it take months before you get scurvy? But we're going back centuries. <laughs> Yeah, but I'm not going to like age for centuries in the travel. I'm going to go back to the old times for like a day and then I'm going to come back to the present, right? How, like how do your vitamin levels stay the same? Because you haven't been to the future to have your vitamins yet because you're in the past. <laughs> no, I like... <laughs> like today, this morning I had orange juice or something. So I have a good amount of vitamin C. But this I go morning back. hasn't happened when you go back into the it past. It already happened because this happened after I traveled back in time. Doesn't make any sense. Pretty sure we're gonna. Is this get broken scurvy. now, or am I? Uh, is it okay that I just pulled a piece off of the machine, or? You needed that piece, for things. No, but you own 100% orange juice. <laughs> yes, I do. That's the name of the game. Oh, oh! I thought he was so fascinated by the citrus. <laughs> conversation that he wanted to he had questions about your juice drinking habits yeah i played 100 percent orange juice earlier today so i should be good for like a month in the past right <laughs> how much orange juice has christopher had that's his problem <laughs> what the heck is this kiwi wants to know if you'll play with him will you play with me if you play i will stream uh, okay, but like, probably not tonight. Is there anything else here? Yeah, Kiwi. He's- I get to stream tonight. No, there's no way down there because we have to help Christopher get down there. That's our What well, that means is like, why did this not close? If, like, because this game closed, like in, in the previous puzzles, the, the, the portraits or whatever we want to call these, close when there's nothing left to do. I it's staying that, open. I think flying. that thing is keeping it open. And I can never revisit again. So I guess there was nothing left to do. Ship key pieces. Is that is that for this? I guess it was for this. What am I doing? Oh. Uh, oh wow, that's actually really hard to see. But not really hard to solve. <laughs> so the balloon, basically. This is a story about how my life got turned upside down. I don't know the rest of the lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> my mom sent me to Bel Air or something like that. Yeah. This is a story about how the Griffins found Amadon's tomb. And that's it, I guess. Oh no, it's broken. So not the desk. And then the telescope. I guess that's it. Library. 
Nair Dublin. Dressing corner. Where are all these coins mossy? Because they're really old. But they wouldn't have been old back then. They have scurvy. But didn't they have orange juice? Our beloved Griffin Fellowship, not 100%, was founded by nobles in the Middle Ages to protect the vulnerable, help the needy, and support the poor. In order to maintain its solid financial background, our society invested in brilliant scientists throughout the centuries, becoming the owner of great inventions and ideas that revolutionized living standards. Thanks to our innovative approach, we could, among many other things, travel through time to scrutinize important events of the past. However, the more we traveled through time, the more we understood the risks and dangers. At last, the Secret Five, our secret directorate, banned time travel. However, we didn't destroy the time machine. We hid it, swearing to use it only as a last resort should something horrible happen. Wasn't this the exact same yeah, plot of the um, last one? The last note, you mean, that we found? The last document or whatever? The last secret order game. No. Oh. The last time we had to find five rings. Because they hid them so that you couldn't do time travel anymore because they discovered the risks and benefits of time travel and the risks outweighed the benefits. Yeah. That's why they hid the rings. Yeah. Okay. But You're I'm, like, no, last time we were finding rings. Yeah, different plot. <laughs> but my point is this document is almost exactly the same as the last document we found. Yeah. So this document didn't add anything to the game. Flavor. But it's the same flavor as the last document. Like, both I said, right, but there's like, a shit. You know shift. how sometimes you have, like, a piece of candy and then you want another piece of candy, even though it's the same flavor? That's not happening for this <laughs> flavor. <laughs> <laughs> I can find a disguise here. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about Christopher. <laughs> it's a good thing they reminded you. I want these coins though. When I look at the cup, the first thing I think is I need instructions on how to make gunpowder. I think that whenever I look at anything, <laughs> especially horse nozzles, for example. Wow, that was very gentle tapping. You just need a little tap to open it. It was so gentle. It was just like the tiniest little doop. <laughs> she poked me while she was saying that just but sure. like really gently here's a griffin statue okay here's a cog wheel yep um there's something on top of that cage is that shackles it looks more like a pillory it was but... stocks which is oh, yeah stocks, basically yeah. pillory uh shackles hanging around the wooden Post. Yes, this? very subtle. A <laughs> wine teeth? What? <laughs> you know, the abstract <laughs> concept. I'm surprised this isn't something we have to create in some way. What is a wine thief? Is it this thing? I hope that's something you pick up. Or is it? Yeah, this is something you pick up. And then you stick it in here. And now I can have some rum, I guess. But we don't want rum, we want a wine thief. Or we could find the hook. We can come back to what the fuck a wine thief is later. Okay. Like this? Is this a hook? I meant this thing here. Yeah, there's another one on the other side of the um oh, here's a meadow. Cage. Oh, I see, there's four of them. And there's one in the cloth. And there's a little grappling hook there, yeah. Wheat. Wheat. Like will. Wheat? Like what? Will Wheaton. Oh, Will Wheaton. Wheaton, <laughs> like, that's it. what? The eagle is, yeah. Okay, a red crown. So here's some red stuff. And there's a crown Where's on the barrel. The oh, there? Yeah. So do I need a paintbrush or something? Yeah, obviously. Here. Then a painting. I sure wish I had that paintbrush. <laughs> How about that? Oh. What? What did we just do? We got a painting somehow. Okay. We need probably a cup for the rum. Or like a jug? Sure, if you see a jug. Well, there's, a, yeah, that thing, no. Unless I just turn it. I need a container into which to pour the rum. There's a little cup inside the cage there. 
there? Uh, no, no that cage, yeah. Sorry, there's a lot of cages. It's a pretty cagey puzzle. Uh -huh. Oh, that's the one we wanted, obviously. <laughs> now! How about that bag that's around um, that bottle? Um, way to the left. Yeah, is that a wine thief? Obviously not. Um, wow. That was the wine thief. That thing. What is a wine <laughs> thief? I, I just showed it to you. Literally seconds ago. I don't think you did. This is a harpoon gun. Might be useful for later. I need to put the anchor up, but the wheel is missing. What do you mean the wheel is missing? I see a wheel right here. So this whole time we still haven't helped Chris get down here so that he can help us dress or something. I don't know. Oh, I hope he doesn't help us dress. That would be weird. Well, we're about to dress, but then we stop and say, if only Chris were here. This wine thief that you can buy on the internet allows you to draw samples and take a hydrometer reader at the same time. You should post a link to that to my stream. Yeah. It's only $11, you guys. I don't think she's going to do it. It's from Midwest Supplies, www.midwestsupplies.com, and it's called the Firmtech Wine Thief. And uh, it gets four and a half stars with 166 reviews. <laughs> 166 people have reviewed this wine thief. How the heck am I going to get Chris? Oh, maybe I can go to the cave hall. The top one says, it's okay. It would be better if it did not drip so much. So he like used it in real life, is, is what that, that means. This person wrote, works as advertised. This unit has simplified taking specific gravity readings immensely. I would recommend this tool. Wow. What's only 11? The, the wine thief. The wine thief? <laughs> That you can also get hyd hydrometer readings at the same time. I absolutely do not understand how to help Chris. Get down there? Yeah. Maybe... Did you put the cogwheel in that thing? In what thing? That thing that's next to him? Oh, here. That's probably what we have to do. I need our piece, I guess. Okay. Too bad we can't get dressed without Chris. Christopher. I don't even know why I need the plank. I am pretty confused as to what I'm supposed to be doing. I guess the injector is just gonna say to help Chris. Just can I walk into the four tracks that happened years ago, so I have to help him find a way to safely lower his witcher. Yeah, got it. But like there's not even there's no interactable point where he is, as far as I can and so I say, okay, maybe I have to build a winching mechanism somehow here. Mm-hmm. But like that seems There's plausible. There's no relevant interactable points here. Oh, what about this thing? Okay, that might be the thing we need to construct. Oops. To finish uh, constructing whatever the hell this thing is. It's a winching mechanism.
<laughs> they made wheelchair friendly ships back in the uh, 1500s. Where are we? 1648. It would take several lifetimes just to read all of these books. And, but there's no time now. You must rescue the wayfarer before he's executed today. He's oh, that's what we're doing. At the castle. But you'll never get there wearing these modern clothes. Don't worry. There should be some period appropriate ones in the dressing corner. He is going to help us get dressed. Uh. <laughs> oh, you have to put them on in order, I think. Um What's the Probably order? the um like one of the slips. This? Uh maybe that one. This is a diagram? Oh here we go. Uh oh I want this. I oh guess. we're putting together specific outfits, like okay. This. And then was it this one? I think Well, maybe yeah, it's this one. No, I think it's the black one. This? Yeah. Yep. And then like and a bonnet. Yeah. They all look the freaking same to me. Like, is right. anyone really gonna look at this and say, wait a minute, yes. you're not from around here. Yes. Oh, I have to put all, all the outfits together, together. Yeah. Gosh. This is not the type of game I signed up for. Yeah, these objects are clearly visible. <laughs> Now I look like a normal townsperson, which I can't see because uh -huh. this mirror. Oh, is this just a blind thing? I thought this was a mirror. Yeah, I think, but it's, I think it's a, a privacy a... gate thing. For your dressing corner. Wait, so we don't even get to see our own outfit? Nope. Lame. I'm being pretty lost here. Wait, we did all that to get him down there just for him to tell us, like... That we should wear clothes. <laughs> wow. Look at these bees. Pull these nails out of my finger. I just realized there's a kid here. Recognize me, but I shouldn't bother you. Whatever you do, don't go through the main entrance. The guards are blocking it. Don't worry though. Castles like these always have a secret entrance, so the king can make a quick escape. The key to this secret path is a medallion. Here's a piece of it. Good luck. This kid is pretty um, ballsy talking to me like that. Yeah. Also, Odd looking, and also, did you notice how even children know how to pronounce brooch? He didn't say brooch. He did. I thought you said medallion. Nope. I can saw things here. Good to know. Why would she say that? Why would she say I can see things here? It's the olden times. <laughs> Like this. Whoa! He's <laughs> <laughs> pissed. That's fantastic. Do it again. <laughs> it's still awesome. <laughs> Bear nozzle. <laughs> So we need to find a fish pot. Uh, I think it's that, um... The basket? No. This thing? No, uh, to the this left thing? of that. Left this? No, uh, to the left. This? To the left. That thing? This thing? 
It's like a... That's a thing that catches fish. Yeah, but I wouldn't call it a fish pot. Well, I you call it a fish and the game cage. disagree. Here's a basket. Sure. Coral. Like this? Uh, no, that's a shell, I think. The coral is on the blanket. This? What's it? Where's the blanket? Oh, this. Saw blade. Yep. Chalice. This? Sure. Wheel. Maybe this. Yeah. A crab. Is this a crab? Yeah. Maybe. It's no, it might not be a shell. This? That maybe could be a crab. It's He's a crab. cute. Seahorse. Um, down and to your uh, left. Sundial. Yep. Angel. Yep. Or... I like that the bird is making noise. Yeah. It's not a shark tooth. Try poking the bird. It literally was to poke. No, it's to do something with the bird. It's stuck. I can't pull that with my bare hands. Wait, so this is gonna be something elaborate because there's only one thing <laughs> that involves the bird. This thing. Wait, maybe that is a shark too. And something else. Or maybe it doesn't involve the bird. Maybe the bird is just there is to. Is this like, for fun? Yeah. There's sort of some tongs at the top at the edge of that boat, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the bird was just for fun. Just for fun. I'm not the first person who thought poke the bird. <laughs> The heck is this piece of the ornaments missing? What is this thing? Blue medallion piece, okay. Bridge? Or this guy? No, I'm in the mood to talk. If there's anything you want, then come back later. I guess he's saying that to us. It's not us self narrating. <laughs> Just wandering up to him and going, hey dude, I'm not in the mood to talk. passes through my town without permission. This isn't the time to sightsee, ma'am. So turn around and be on your way. I feel like that accent is not period appropriate. The kid also. Hey, yeah. Listen. Hey, look. He's cut the you, dragon tattoo. I help, but I need some help first. See, when I was patrolling the forest this morning, a bear attacked me. I managed to escape, but I lost my helmet. If I'm not wearing it when the changing of the guard starts, I won't get any supper tonight. Find my helmet, and I'll get you inside. Fair deal. Oh, this guy. Poke the bird. <laughs> Don't threaten the bird with a... <laughs> hey, this guy. Oops. I want to check out the waterfall. Let the thing work. It's beautiful. Oh, no. Not again. I'm getting too old for- Hey! Don't you know not to- Say, you're that traveler, aren't you? The one with wow. the air problem? Word spreads pretty fast. For a price. You see, my son's a hunter. If you fix my mill, I'll give you the key to his hunting cabin. Mm. You're bound to find something useful there. This is the kind of hidden object game that we like. Like- <laughs> Weird locals being like, if you do some chores for me, I will give you some useless objects. Do you remember where we saw that thing that said, I could saw here? I could see here, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> A wooden rattle. How about in the center of the stump? Because there's not a lot of other... This? Yeah. Oh yeah, I know what that is now. I don't call those things a rattle, but I guess they could be. They're the things that like you spin yeah. like this, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Noisemaker, maybe? If only you guys could see the hand motion Stephanie was oh, doing there. Oh, I was making the, the appropriate... Hand motion for when you're using a wooden rattle. Yeah. <laughs> the stag beetle is in the middle of the stump under... yeah. 
Dragonfly. Is it this thing? Yeah. I can't tell what that is. Frog. Don't you love finding frogs? I do. In it's games? a lot of frog. Yeah. There's a lot of uh, amphibians, butterfly. I should say. Yeah, there's one. There's How do one. I know if it's a moth or a butterfly? You know the answer to that. <laughs> You have been around me enough. There's one on the mushroom and one uh, under the blueberries. Yeah, but maybe maybe some viewers don't know. How would you know? Generally, that? moths rest with their wings um, down and open, and butterflies rest with their wings up. There you have it, folks. Little rule of thumb. There's a chipmunk. There is a chipmunk. The ladybug is on one of the pink ro um Yeah. Sure, bird. The salamander is back where the stag beetle was. This? Oh, I don't oh, think this? so, yeah. I think that's the salamander. I think it's this then. Um, that's like a lizard. The hedgehog is, is peeking out. Now I know how you feel with katanas <laughs> and rapiers. <laughs> <laughs> the acorn is straight down from where you are. Like, it's just, it's just like it's all just yeah. bullshit. Is basically what it is. <laughs> and then the egg Why is... would anyone know this? <laughs> Backward. What up. kind of loser would memorize these things? <laughs> the hedgehog was in a nest. Wait, where? What? Uh, yeah, right there. Yeah, yeah and to me, it's like, duh. How could Wait, you? Wait, why do we get see? this thing? You to need scare to the scare bird? the bird. Why? I thought crows were smart. When t I, you know, I'm gonna shake this, and but he's, you're gonna do the hand gesture. Yeah, and then he's <laughs> gonna be the like, scary part. so you know, he's gonna shrug and like. like Maybe the they're not period appropriate. Maybe he's never heard one before. It's like, oh fuck! I'm getting out of here. <laughs> what is this? He dropped a the flute twine. or something like that. It's twine. No, but there's some like I see there's string or twine, and then there's like a stick or something like that. So I thought it was like a little whistle that you might like, and the oh, string is to keep it on so. your neck or your wrist or something. Maybe you can lasso the bear with it. Maybe it's a bear nozzle. Yep, good point. I should tighten the frame, like with this? Whoa, um, that is not what I thought would happen. In fact, I don't understand how any of this works. I think it it's, hold, I, I feel like it's it pulling tight. these tight, yeah. which makes these expand, and then yeah. that holds the the blade in, in place somehow yeah. i don't see how that would do that though we'll look that up later is this a sharpening file yeah okay i assume it didn't say but that's what i assume we're doing with this where is it is it this thing yeah Saw. The music just took an odd turn. They're just, um, it's like just pull something from the royalty free pack and <laughs> stick it in there. <laughs> Need to secure the blades. Oh, I can probably use the pliers to get nails from that post it board. Oh, the board, right. Those look more like. Uh, Fire and iron. Like Look, those what? pliers seem like they would be really hard to use. Oh. I'm, I apparently I don't have enough. Oh, we still need more nails? Where could I find more nails? Before I start exploring a ship, I want to do it as a last resort. I want to see. If we... Did we see nails anywhere else? Where's my noisemaker? Did he give us the key to the hunter's cabin yet? No, we have to... Wait, why is our, my key upgraded? I think he wants us to fully repair the... Um... Oh, look at that board there. Oh, yeah. I think he wants us to fully repair his mail before Oh, the he water wheel? Us. Gotcha. Yeah. I feel like I'm getting a massage at a spa with this music. This not as gentle attack. She's punching me. I am tapping shoulder. at the same strength as the hammer. 
people are actually bad. I guess you probably know as a psychologist, but people are bad at evaluating whether they're doing this something at the same strength as something else. Really? They have a experiment where they um, like they tell someone to put their hand on the table, basically, and then they have a robot hand tap them, mm -hmm. and then and then the button is to now tap the button at the same, and they always hit harder than the hand hit them. So you're suggesting that I hit you harder than the hammer hit the nail? Uh, yes, basically. <laughs> like, you know, if, if, you, if people are doing uh, reciprocating punishment, like, I'm going to hit you as hard as you hit me, it's actually going to escalate over time is what... Interesting. It's like new. Thank you for your hard work. Here's the key to the cabin. Good luck. So I don't even know where his cabin is. <laughs> to use the key on it. Oh, is it the place where he got the saw? That's the only cabin I can think of. Oh, I guess we couldn't get inside. Hunter's house, there we go. Crossbow. <laughs> it's gonna be like a billion, you know, like crossbow, bear trap, you know, like all. Right. And then it's like useful item, the letter V. The letter V, right? <laughs> the you're straight above you is the yeah crossbow. Or an apple. Apple. Saw. Saw. Oh, I bet the smoker. that might possibly be a useful item. This thing. Could be. We've definitely used a bee smoker in hidden object games. Hidden object games before. Published by Artifacts Monday. <laughs> Bear trap. This thing. Yeah. Tusk. Maybe if we put the tusk on our face, we can scare the, the bear away. I feel like that's probably exactly what's going to happen. Like this? I don't, like, I don't see that's anything. That's an antler. I don't see anything else that could be a tusk. Uh, up on the top shelf? Could Yeah, to, a little bit to your left. There's like a white thing. Is that a tusk? Axe. Next to the skeleton of the, um, yeah. Horseshoe. Yep. Bullets. Bullets. Oh, sure. Like shot. Pipe. So see ne pas un peep. Say un peep. This? Oh wow. It wasn't that. I guess that's the handle of this pot. Yeah. Oh, up, straight up, 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 up there. Powder flask. That looked like an eggplant. Now we have our bee smoker. How are we gonna scare a bear with a bee smoker? The B in bee smoker stands for bear. <laughs> Forget these bear traps, or the crossbow, or the bullets. Isn't there a part, uh, some part where we have to make gunpowder? Yeah. I forget all that, we're just gonna smoke the bees. Alright. What is this? Saltpeter. It's a. They're ingredients and for um, gunpowder. What about that game that taught us how to build a bomb that we streamed <laughs> on, <laughs> on Twitch? Yeah, that was disturbing. <laughs> you I guess we should have known when we played the Anarchist Cookbook <laughs> Hidden Object Game. Attract more bears of honey than vinegar. There's some bear butts. Wait, like, really? That's what we did? Is we, like... Gave him some honey. Wow. We lured the bees to sleep and then fed them to the bear. I need something to cut this medicinal herb with. Oh, wow. Why wouldn't I just pick it? I might find a use for these reeds, but I'll need something to cut them with. Oh, I want to click on the bird. Nice touch, game makers. I approve. I need to hack the lock somehow. 
probably not with any of these things. I think that's it for this place. So let's give the guy his helmet so you he can have supper tonight. That's it! My stomach and I thank you, ma'am. Oh? You fancy my necklace with a medallion piece, do you? <laughs> Tell you what, bring me its worth in gold, and you've got a deal. I have a family to feed, and some gold would compensate a poor soldier's wages. Give seven gold coins to the guard. Vendor Fort Road. How reminds me of a medallion like this one? Sure does remind me of a medallion. Only the complete medallion would work. It's a ladder, but the grid is locked. <laughs> I just took a wing off the church. <laughs> Medallion piece, huh? Everyone wants something, don't they? What about my needs? My daughter is terribly ill, but I can't leave my shop unattended to search for the healing potion she needs. If you want this medallion so badly, fetch me a healing potion from the alchemist's workshop, and I'll consider it. Make it's like the potion. best part of those <laughs> games where you get quests. Poppy seed pods. Are poppies like red flowers or something like that? Uh, yes. So what um, the seed pods look like for those guys? They look like... Um, Maybe these? Or just radishes? <laughs> I'm waiting for Stephanie to respond before I move on. I don't like. I I can picture what they look like, but I. Is I it don't like this? See anything? It's not this. It doesn't. That, that's not what I think of when I think of a poppy seed pod. Okay. Like picture a poppy, right? Like yep. the papery, wrinkly stuff, and then it sort of dries out, and the pod is seed pod is left. <laughs> So not this thing. <laughs> I mean, you can click on it and I see, but it. but like that, like that right there. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Oh, why didn't you say so? Because I couldn't see it because I'm way back here. No, I mean, why did you say it looked like this folded up papery pod of a poppy seed <laughs> like wrinkles up and it's dried and stuff? Can you like mentally feel me hitting you? <laughs> like how hard does that feel? <laughs> Where is this a pitchfork? If it is, it's a terrible pitchfork. It was. Oh, the man. whole time. It was a salmon? Yeah. Ham. Yes. Uh, pumpkin. It's behind... Uh, the. Uh, go to the watermelon and then go behind the watermelon. Yeah. It's a good way of describing it. Grape? They're hanging from the... It's um, not this? No. It's not like just a, one giant like grape? <laughs> this. Yeah, uh, novelty size. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the pear is also pear. behind the watermelon. Behind the watermelon. This? Yep. Hot peppers. Yep. Nut. Zero There's out of four. There's one in the scale. There's one over by the pineapple. Uh, there's one up. Yep. Nut. Nut. I just realized, you know, I've always been calling you pumpkin. Pirate, but I just realized now it's it's pumpkin. Pumpkin. Pump. I was pumpkin. I I was calling him pumpkin. I mean, it's like it's like a pumpkin. pet name way of saying pumpkin. Pun pumpkin. So. Pumpkin. pumpkin. Okay. I hate pumpkin. Um. So you see the scale? Yeah. Go down. Yeah. There you go. Corn. Yeah. Now we need to find a hat. Right there. 
Now we need to find a pineapple slice. Oh, I found the pineapple, and there's a knife in the watermelon. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> there's no possible <laughs> way I could be thinking what you're thinking. So we got poppy seed pod. <laughs> Is that part of our... It's our useful object. Part of our medicinal... Nah, it's just See? useful. This is useful. This is then. generally useful. Well, sometimes you're like trying to describe a poppy seed pod to someone and you're like, yeah. I sure wish So now I you can just one. show one and yeah. see, this is what I'm talking about. That's so useful. There's the alchemist. Just grab another wing from something. <laughs> Smithy. This is more town than we usually get. Nobody here. I guess I can just use this stuff. Probably instructions. Like, do not touch, for example. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know what I'm doing right now, for example. Oh. Wow, look at this numbering system. What the hell? So here's poppy seed, mm -hmm. the flowers, water, water. and reeds. Some reeds. Did we get some sort of scissors yet? Scissors. We got a dragon horn. Okay. Is that like a scissor? It might be. I need a basic potion to make a healing potion. You gotta start oh. with the basics first. Distillery guide. It's like a guide to the good distilleries in the area. You know what I ask myself when I'm have traveled back in time on a time boat? <laughs> What? The 1648? What do you ask yourself? I say, what would dad do? I can't read any of this shit, so <laughs> this is gonna be tough. Is this like the saltpeter? I mean, these all three of these things look identical to me. Also, it's, I feel like it's warning me about something, but I don't know what here. It's making gunpowder. I just get potion bottle. Crocodile. That's very cool. What the heck is this? That petroleum. is petroleum. You never know when you might need that. Wow, we're carrying a lot of stuff. We're gonna have to forge something at some point. Chain. It's stuck. There must be some trick to taking it. Oh no, put it against. See where it goes? Yeah, there you go. So we're tying up someone's... There's not... Oh, I guess... Yeah. yeah, that's it. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, doing chores in these games. This is this? Mm -hmm. Like, the hilt doesn't match. I think it's that. Well... There's a mason clubs over, or whatever, I don't even know how. Yeah, right there. Morning star. What's it called? Morning star. Yeah, it's a salamander. <laughs> uh, 
up to the far... yeah, that thing. No? Not that little hammer in the end? Hmm. It has to be a perfectly straight... And it, it looks like a key, I'm not even sure what that is. Oh, how about the key next to the... yeah. I was reading once a description of how a lot of games really just involve kind of making a mess and tidying things up, like especially ones that humans like, like um, pool and bowling and um, solitaire and um, uh, like it's it's kind of about like making a mess and then putting it back in perfect order or something to sort of uh, appealing about that to the human brain. An interesting theory. Still, we're apparently missing more dragon parts. But we looted all of them from the town. Oops. There's no way I can enter there. Alright, what do we got here? I guess I can bring the gunpowder recipe to the boat. Right. Oh, this guy can't talk to him yet. <laughs> oh, hey, lass. Oh, what? Get to aid a fellow traveler. <laughs> See that ship in the bay? She needs to dock, but quick and stealth like. <laughs> if you catch my trip. <laughs> All you got to do is send a signal to my crew from the lighthouse. Once my cargo's found, save harbor, I'll give you this this lovely trinket I found. Okay. This pig will get you into the lighthouse. Take it. <laughs> what exact voice was that? Just a generic shady guy, I guess. You know what, I'll do this later. I feel like we're not going to have to, like, I'm going to do all the boat stuff in one go, basically. Okay. Picture the lighthouse is hiding something. I think these pieces might turn. Yeah, I'm just trying to find the edges. First. That one might. But it looks like they don't really have edges. Oops. And they don't snap together either. You only snap to, I guess, their solution spots. Try that top um, right one. Top right, and yeah, there you go. Oh my gosh, there it is. Flip. Harvest plants now. Thanks to my golden coin. Uh, 
What? What kind of hook is that called? A reaping hook. Oh. Oh, I got the coins now. That was not the word that I read. Oh, the coins we gotta give the guy. Yeah. There's a lot of things happening in this one. I need to fill, fill this thing with something flammable. Like gunpowder? Like oh, petroleum. No. Like petroleum. Oh, apparently that did it. Is it doing it? I need something to light up. What happened to my lighter? I don't think we've had the lighter in a while. Well, I guess we're screwed then. Guess we'll go reap some reeds. And the medicinal herb. Oh, now we lost our reaper. You don't have to fear it. Ah, he I'm stuck his tongue face. out. I'm making a face time, that one face. makes when we when one hears a bad <laughs> pun. <laughs> An amazing pun is what you mean. Wait, show me your amazing pun face. <laughs> it's the same face. So this is I guess this is one reads two flower? No, poppy whatever. Yeah, poppy seed pad. I think I get the numbering system and now. This is three because it's got three yeah. lines. And then we four is water maybe, or is maybe. it? I think crunch? we pestle it up. Yeah. Oh, it's water. No, no, no. Use the pestle. Or the mortar? Which part is which? Good question. Thank you. Now I got my basic potion. A bottle. I have that. Where is it? Here, potion bottle. Assembly guide. Is we have it? a distillery guide, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Look at this this diagram again. So I'm assuming we start by heating up the thingy. Oh, okay, that was that thing. What? Do I need this? What the, what the hell is this? And the pipe, I guess, to connect those two things together, maybe? No? I'm trying to do, trying to do this thing, but it's not letting me. Yeah, the only thing I'm missing, I think, is, is down here. Oh, what's this? Maybe that's what... There we go. Alchemy. So I assume that's a healing potion, yeah. So I guess I give it to the... Um, the lady who needs a healing potion? I guess I poured on the street to, to spite her. I feel like that's... saved my little darling's life. Incorrect. Take this. It's yours now. Purple medallion piece. So it's not even what I want, because I want the blue medallion piece. Well, I can yeah, you might need like five different Thanks to you. Tonight my family will pieces like or something. Kids. Now a red medallion piece. Oh, maybe they combine together. 
That's what I was thinking. Yeah, but I was right and you were wrong, so... What? I don't know how to assemble these pieces. Because I can't stick one of them because he says only a complete that will work. Maybe there will be a board on which to assemble them or something. So what do we do now? Do we go to the ship with the gunpowder? Sure. So we're running out of uh, puzzles to solve. We still need like mirror shard pieces, is that right? For the lighthouse? Oh, I thought it would be like... I think it's the wording was we need to light something to light it with. Yeah, but then it said something about mirror shard pieces. I don't remember that, but uh, I'll take your word for it. Cannon packer. I keep that right next to my wine thief. I think it's like it looks like a big toy brush. It's oh, probably the same. Oh yeah, gotcha. Scissors. Up. Oh. Yes. Planner. Or planer. planer. More plane. Yes. Why not a planner? Because planner has two ends, and is a different object. The same? No, it's the uh, it's on the other side of that crate, um, behind the red paint. Yeah, that thing. You run it across the board, and it makes it smooth by taking these little shavings off. I was doing a gesture <laughs> that also people can't see. Yeah, she was doing the gesture that one would do when one uses a a planner. Yeah. <laughs> keys. Which was confusing because I was using a planer. Yeah, it was a more plain keys. planner. Scale weight. This, no. I mean, yeah, but that's probably not what they mean. Maybe it is. Maybe one of them is the weight. No. A planer planner. Pla planner? Planer? Easy for a you planer, to say. A planer planner? Because we were talking about a planner, right? With no. an e like ER. No, we were talking about Chicago Hope. I don't know what that is. It's the opposite of ER. Help this. Yeah. Office of ER. ER is a television show about emergency rooms. Yeah, one specific emergency room. But not the Chicago Hope one. Right. A different. The opposite of that one. We need to find the fetter. <laughs> Obviously. Is this a fetter? Could be. There's a, a moth. moth on the rope. How do you know if it's a moth or a butterfly? Well, as your listeners, your regular listeners know, the I mean, saw let's... is behind, is between the barrels there. Yeah. Canteen. You should be able to do the lizard. Actually, the lizard is a little thing on the wall. Is this a boot? Or is that a hat? It looks a lot like a hat, but I don't know for sure. It's a boot. Nope, it's a boot. The axe is what you thought the planer was. Or detective. <laughs> that was not... What you were expecting? The useful object I was hoping for. Yeah, we gotta repair the telescope. I forgot about that. Okay, so do it. <laughs>
I can't just leave this here, I have to carry it around with me. Oh, maybe we can use a chain for the anchor thing. Is no, it starting to get heavy? It was missing a wheel, I think. It wasn't missing a chain? Let me go check that. Yeah, the wheel is missing. Flint and steel, blue time piece, upgrade key. What are we supposed to do with all this junk? Hide it. Can you go back to the dressing room? There's an extremely shiny mirror in there, but we can't use it? Okay, I just want to make sure. I don't know what any of these things are. Oh wait, flint and steel, you can use that to light the lighthouse, right? Yeah, maybe. Why don't we just use that from since the beginning? Let me just use my map, I don't want to walk all the way back we're, there. We're dumb? Are we... If only there was an elevator that would take me straight <laughs> from the ship. Oh, now you want an <laughs> elevator. So all this walking. Okay. Brilliant, but the mechanism is not ready yet. The mechanism is not ready yet. Are you fucking... The mirror shards are missing from the device. That's what you oh. were talking about. Oh, oh. Even though nowhere what? earlier up until this point did they ever mention anything about mirror shards. I traveled back into the past <laughs> to find out what used to be in there. All right, so where are the mirror shards? I don't know. Inside the, the lens of the... The ship? Yeah. So uh, just that's why I was like, that, remember that mirror that's in the dressing room? What if we had that mirror? Yeah, just to save us a bit of time, when I looked at the map in the ship, there was no action available here. Okay, that's useful information. Even though it's a bit of a cheating, but I don't want to do the tedious walk all the way back. Oh, the wayf wafer was his guardian? Oh, can I do it here? Purple. Blue. Red I have. Maybe he gives us the other trinket. Oh yeah, because he said he had a trinket yeah. he found. Yeah. Quote unquote. Yeah. <laughs> Just found it somewhere. Just found it. If I f go all the way to the castle and I still haven't found anything, I'm probably gonna look at the map to see where. Wait, this is a ladder, but the grid is. Oh, that would open the grid. Okay, gotcha. And we'll look at the map and see where the action available is. What are we trying to make here? The shield.
What does he want? One more wing, I think. It looks like he has... He has one wing? I'm not sure if this thing is also a wing. Did you try, like, putting the brooch in there or anything, just in case? The brooch? The eye of the dragon is missing. Okay. And the tooth of the dragon is missing. Okay. Alright, time to consult our map. Action available in the lighthouse, interesting. So we can do something here. Did you try touching that button? Nothing. Um, mirror shards? How the hell do we have an action of bubble here? That's where we are. Unless he's pointing at this one, rather than this one. But it feels like he's pointing at this one, the top Well, part. let's go down to the bottom one just in case. Shocking thing right here. Obs. Hopefully we can go get that. <laughs> I just realized, like, I didn't say anything about the racism there, but like, sure, he's he has a yellow piece. Oh wow! <laughs> Nicely done, lass. You held up your half of the bargain, so as promised, this trinket's yours. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> So now we have the Five Faces Medallion. And we gotta do another hidden object. So let's see. Message in the bottle. That was a demijohn. I don't know what the hell a demijohn was. Here we go. Message in the bottle. Flowers. One, two, three. Four, five, gargoyle, necklace, probably this thing, tortoise shell, tortoise shell, I thought I saw a turtle down here somewhere, but I don't see it anymore, like I mean last time we were, oh here it is, crossbow, fishbone, starfish, I was going to click on this thing but I no longer think, oh here it is. Seashells. One, two, three, four? Nope. Four, five? Nope. Five, six, six. Oh, six, here it is. Come on, that's not a shell? You're kidding me. This thing? Loot. That's this guy. Charcoal. Is that a spoon? This bowl is empty. Shovel will come in handy. You saw your charcoal, fine. Let's open the gate to the, the well. Wow, that's spooky. It's a spooky well. He 
Here's the other shell piece. This shape reminds me of a shield. Can't jump over cliff, I need something to go through it. Okay, we're probably gonna repair the shield basically. Metal needs to be heated up before I can work. I have no idea what I'm doing. Like, I don't know why that would cause the shield to bond, but uh, that's what I know other blacksmiths do, so I guess I'll just hit it with my hammer. So we got our repaired shield now, which I assume means we are going to stick this here and maybe a bridge will magically appear. What do you know? Across the ridge, what the heck is this thing? Dragon tooth. One piece is missing from this mechanism. It's our bird. Ooh. What is that? Oh, the dragon's eye. It's too far for me to jump, when I assume she doesn't want to swim. Okay, but we probably have all the dragon components now. So we can head over to the dragon. Stick this here, stick this here. Grab this thing. Stone piece. Not sure, but I'm assuming that's going to be for this puzzle here. So I just stick this here somewhere. Oop. So I guess we're sliding all the pieces. Um, to where they need to go. I don't know. I, I wasn't here for the introduction of this puzzle, but that description sounded like every single hidden object puzzle <laughs> ever. We're just sliding the pieces where they need to go. Yep. I have to swap these two locations. There we go. These graphics are pretty good. They, they almost feel out of place for the rest of the game, in fact. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Keep it down! Can I have just one hour of peace before I die? What? what? You want to help me? You, you do realize that, that helping me risk your neck too, right? In that case, never mind. <laughs> what does the lever do? The opening switch is stuck. I need to hang something heavy here to move the switch. A chain. And then this weight thingy. I need a hook or something to hang it on. How about that hook right there? That object was not that hidden. I heard many a tall tale, but y you're just the tallest. <laughs> so, you're from the future, and you need the scepter to save your father and the Order of the Griffins. Well, you did save my neck. I, I, I owe you that much. Here, take this. It will lead you to the scepter. Now... If you'll excuse me, I must find my little companion whom I need to take care of. <laughs> Godspeed! Godspeed, my friend! I like how he said whom. Yep. Solution key. So that's probably for that pile of rocks near the mill. Or here. Oh, is this the planets in order? You know the planets? My very eminent mother just served us nine pizzas. Yeah, but I mean these, do you know these? No. But we have that handy little grid. 
guy with a two There's no way this is right. Guy with oh, that's toupee. Venus. Okay, it is right. Guy it is right. A yeah. Sorry, I thought this was Mars. I'm like, there's no way this is the symbol for Mars, but uh. this is Venus. Uh, Earth. Mars. The next ring is this guy. Four. And is that already on the right one? Looks like it. Pitchfork. It's called an anus. Is that, is that even right? I think Pluto and yeah Uranus need this to Uranus. switch. Oh, this is Pluto. Okay, Neptune. Yeah, the trident. Uh. Wait. Yeah, that one and, and the other one need to switch. Yeah, that and that. So the symbol for Uranus is literally an Aeneas. Really? That's where you're going? Well, it's a dot with a circle around it, right? If I go back to the Alchemist's workshop, I should find something to help reveal the map's contents. Just pour random water on it. The other region goes first. I don't know how she knows that. Place the map and set sail. I guess we are placing the map and setting sail then. Oh, I see. This is a map for the scepter, I guess. Oh. That's why we care about any of this at all. Ah. Because the last person to know about it was the wayfarer, but he was going to be executed. Yeah. I must pull up the anchor, fix the ship's wheel, tear the rock down. It's a decent amount of work to do. So how do I make gunpowder? I found something interesting while you were away. See that hollow above the shelf? I'm positive it's a secret compartment. I don't see the hollow about the shelf. This thing? Nope, it's a secret compartment. Steering symbol, cabinet key. Is there a cabinet that I need the key of? Alright, charcoal maybe? Yep. Then maybe saltpeter? Who knows? Nope. Salt, flint and steel? Nope. Then what is it? I have no idea what this is. Charcoal. Something. And I guess this thing is soft Peter. And I don't have the other thing. So let's uh, find a cabinet who's, that we need a key for. Maybe this one here. The Dragon Clan, our most formidable enemy, was created by a secret circle of wealthy merchants in the 16th century. Their goal, like their namesake, is to accumulate as much wealth as possible by controlling world trade. They'll do anything for money. No method is too extreme. They take advantage of the poor, enslaving them. They've built their businesses on, business on the suffering of others and have only become stronger throughout the centuries. Once they found out about our order, of course, destroying us became a priority. We keep tabs on their activities all over the world so that every member of our order can be protected. It feels like a never-ending battle. Anchor wheel. That's convenient. Oh. I didn't mean to go this way, but since we're going this way anyway, let's place the anchor wheel. Sure. I was trying to go back to the uh, steering wheel part of the ship. It actually makes sense that the nautical museum was a piece of shit because they didn't really care like this is all all they care about is hiding the ship right so they're just like just get random museum shit and, and put it there so we can hide 
Yeah, but then they put it in like a gigantic, super fancy. Well, it had to be big enough to magically enchanted to guard hold the, uh, the whale time skeleton. Boat. Yeah, but like, have you ever been to a maritime museum? They're usually this like eight feet by twelve feet, <laughs> and they're full of like ores from the fifteenth century. <laughs> Do you remember that time we went to that museum? There was one room, like it was in Canada. It was like yes. a beaver museum or some shit yes. like that. <laughs> like the beaver museum. Yeah. It was it was one guy's room, yes. like the yeah. whole museum. I remember they were like, were like, "Do you want a guided tour?" We were like, like "God, no." <laughs> <laughs> remember? That's what I mean. Like that's the that's what a nautical museum is usually like. They don't usually. Like, it doesn't usually have stairs, for example, much less other rooms. I don't know how we're going to do the gunpowder, because I don't know what the other material is. We'll figure it out. Well, what I mean is I don't know any of any open puzzles. I thought we've been everywhere, done everything. Consult your map. Fine. Nothing here. Okay, so let's leave the ship. Is this part of the ship? This is considered part of the ship. Or the ship map, anyway. All the way back here at the Alchemist, there's something we can do here. We needed that. Sulfur, of course. I'm just gonna teleport to the ship, cause screw walking there. Okay, finally, put the sulfur in, put the saltpeter in, and then what? Mix it? Is it mixed? I, I guess it's, it's already mixed. mixed. Cannons over here? Or is that the harpoon? That's a harpoon. Put this in. Pack it. Stick the cannonball in. Rotate it. Oh, you need to pack the cannonball too. Just double packing. Rotate it. It just occurs to me because I've never fired a cannon in real life. There's a wick here, and you light it, right? And that does that mean you need need to replace the wick each time because it burns up the wick? That'd be my guess. The pain. I think they had like you just would have a whole bunch of wicks. I went to um, the Seattle Art Museum this weekend or last weekend um, for they have art from the um, basically the city of Jodhpur, India, um, for the last 500 years, okay. and they have these things called wall guns which they use to defend forts and they look like a rifle but they're the size of a cannon they're like huge, <laughs> wow like well, i guess like a musket but they're like so it's like novelty size or, like it's like novelty size yeah they were huge <laughs> and there was a little kid in there who was looking at them and it was they had a lot of you know they had a reasonable number of guns as part of the exhibit and the little kid was probably like five years old and he was explaining in great detail how the bigger the gun the worse they work <laughs> Okay. I was just impressed that like a five-year-old has seen enough guns to form a theory about that. Welcome to America, I guess. Right? <laughs> Isn't that terrifying? Oh, we're charting a course somehow. I don't like this compass is weird. Like I don't know why it rotates as I move it around like that. It's a time compass. It's a good point. Points towards the future, right? right. <laughs> then point towards north. Right. This one acts pretty good too. Like there's like depth of field blur from like when the camera moves right. around. 
Looks like there's a storm or something that we're heading into. Some sort of like haunted Bermuda Triangle type shit. Mm-hmm. Oh god. It's piercing through our uh We need to free the Royal Griffin. Where am I? It's hard to get a sense of the size because they were like this big around. Our carrier is inaccessible. Here's the ore. I don't know what this is. Lion statue headpiece. You never know when that might come in handy, so let's grab it. Oh, I picked something up and now the this like rod seems to be near its end. I wonder what will happen if I hit it with a sharp tool. I like how towards the end of the game they literally are just like whatever. <laughs> Center piece of this banner is missing. They start having Do you my grab eyes deceive me. A living human. How is it you can move where you please? I can't move because of the crystal. Anyway, could you help me? <laughs> I know we have at least one goal in common, escaping this place. I need my amulet to escape the crystal's power, but it's lost. Head to King Amadon's castle through the Gate of Champions. My king is there. He'll know where to find my amulet. Return it to me, and I'll help free your frigate. How can I get through there? It's impossible. Or maybe it is possible after all. Cursed Marsh. Let's definitely go in a place called the Cursed Marsh. A lot of center pieces of banners missing all around here. What the heck? Is this a peephole or like I don't understand what I guess I'm looking through it? Like it's a peephole. Uh What's that on the side? A wedge. I have to check all of them again. It scares me the dead trees are all over the place. That's the part that scares her. Not the green magic tentacles and graveyard. Or the ghost that's cursed. He seems friendly. Now I can never look in that boat again. Breastplate. Is it this thing? I feel like that's if that's a jewelry. Eh. I guess it maybe yeah. the same. It's just like a random plate. Oh, this is that. That's a breastplate. Yeah. Mask. Yeah. Vase or vase. In the front? Nope. Need a tool to mine that nugget. <laughs> okay. How about S that thing, yeah? Jewelry. That was a claw. Oh, you missed something earlier. We got something called a, a Demijohn. And it, I think it was like a bottle, basically. But... Oh. There's a piece of something that looks like gold in the wall. This? Yeah. That's when I get the weed. Oh, I see. I see. To mine. How about right where you have your thing? Is that a piece of jewelry? A demijohn? Yeah, it was like a bottle or something. Hmm. Obsidian. Uh, that black piece up, 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 up there. Horn. Yeah. Bull. Is 
Is this? Yeah. Stone knife. Yep. Drum. Yep. Cat. Yep. Come on, Duncan. So we need a tool like this guy, I guess. So the end is a useful object, okay. Castle is completely covered in ice. Statue second soil, but I could dig it out with something like a paddle. Too bad I didn't keep my pickaxe. Probably not. I can convert this branch into an axe if I insert a stone here like this. I guess so. Fasten. So I need like a rope or something. Oh, maybe this is what I need the axe for. Carrier is inaccessible. Who does this gigantic castle belong to? The raft has fallen apart. No, that's obviously the rope for the ang uh the yes. axe, not the rope for the raft. This feels like way too much rope for an axe though. Like look at this, like how much rope we got here. It was the perfect amount of rope. <laughs> There's a guy in there. So that storm got to you, hey? Well, the worst ain't over yet. The same thing that happened to me is going to happen to your friend on the frigate. Why would he say it would happen Serena to me? Serena and Cyrus have a crystal here that engulfs every living thing, turning souls into energy. Those two knuckleheads couldn't beat their brother Amadon when they were alive. So even in death, they're still seeking revenge. I ain't dead, but I ain't exactly alive either. Seeing is how I'm eternally anchored here. Unlike us, though, you're free to wander where you please because of that magical brooch around your neck. Would it be too much to ask for your help? Then my soul can leave this hellish place. Good luck to you. Stuck under the beam. A longer chain might help me release the golden piece on the floor. What happened to the chain piece I was carrying just moments ago? Oh, I was not expecting to be able to pick that up. Wish I could leave this cursed island. Attaching the anchor to the chain might help me. Okay. All right, so we have the four wedges. Why do we even want the wedges? So the wedges connect. Oh, the wedges do connect that. Can I use this as a hammer? Yes, I can. It's a multi tool. Multi pass. Too high for me to climb up. As a storyteller who believes in human history, <laughs> I want written records to 
remain about the greatness of Ehrenhart and its greatest king, Amadon. I decided to immortalize every war important event of my life in my journal. I believe our realm must be the utopia for every human being. Since I was a child, I've wanted to move to the prosperous cap capital city of Ehrenhart. Even in this strong empire, good things are always accompanied with their bad equivalent. Ominous clouds are gathering above our beloved kingdom. Today there was another hostile gesture by the king's jealous siblings, Zarina and Cyrus, against the king. This act surpassed all previous viciousness. They declared their claim to the throne. I'm afraid the, that war is imminent. What are they cogwheels? What are they good for? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Looks like every one of them held something in their hands. For example, wait, where the hell is it? This thing? Still need a few more banners. I'll give me this headpiece. Oh wait, maybe these are the things that are missing from the banners. Yep. This part looks good. But, mm -hmm. Well, maybe not this part here. But I don't. That looks okay ish? Yeah, I think that was alright. Like this? Okay. Yep. Then what? Oh, this looks good too. Mm hmm. Uh. No, I guess this part. Because it's, it's purple shirt thing. Is this right? This looks weird. Maybe is this down here? I can't tell. Or is this the empty block? I think that might be the empty one. Or maybe it's this piece. Maybe this piece. Right. Uh, well, all those ones with the with the border have to be on the bottom, right? Yeah, but I need to figure out specifically what goes here. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. Then this piece and maybe this piece? Yeah, maybe. Or is, it, is this when it's empty? Because we're missing one border, one bottom border, right? Mm-hmm. Like, the most natural thing would, would be if it were this one, but, but this actually looks pretty good where it is. I don't love that, but it could be, right? Oops. Do you have to start over? Hope not. No. Okay. Try moving those over. What's that mean? Oh, that's not right. So I think it's just these two need to be swapped. Okay. Or maybe also this guy. Like yeah. These three need like, to be cycled in some way. Yeah. So I think it's like this. There we go. Did it. And what do I get for that? A... The solution that I already could figure out anyway because it's color-coded. The blue one goes to the blue banner. The orange one goes to the sky. Well, now you have... An extra piece of paper I gotta carry around. Yeah. <laughs> is what I have. I've kind of lost track of the plot. Like, Nathan was following us, and we went back in time... To get the to scepter. Get the scepter from the Wayfarer, and now what are we doing? Well... We're just trapped? We crashed, yeah, because this place is cursed or something else. Oh. And this is the kingdom of Ar Rayamon or whatever. Ironheart? Yeah. 
I need one more thing, stick thing, I don't know where it is. Wait, go back to where you were? Don't we need to get under there? We need an anchor, and we need a chain to attach the anchor to lift us so that we can do something. Oh, okay. Um, do we need to dig somewhere? Yeah. Didn't we? Where? Yeah, I feel like. Oh, when you figure out where, let me know. <laughs> Here. Let's dig. I can dig it. What the hell is this? Skeleton. Stone statue. Where do I need a stone statue? But yeah, I'm still missing one more banner. We're missing a piece here, I guess. Something's missing in the center. Oh, this thing? Nope. This couldn't be this thing, could it? That thing might tell us... Um, the sequence. Yeah. Because it's called Sequence of Banners. Yeah. So it might not be totally useless after all. Fine. I'm asking. I'm asking if it might not be totally useless. I still need to find one last freaking banner though. Where's the, What about that banner to the left? Oh, there's a banner here the whole time. How many is just Roy B. Give? Roy G. Biv? Wait, what? First, I need to find the banners. Well, here they are. Yellow, green, orange. Oh, you don't even have to <laughs> memorize it. You could have figured that out without the. Well, we could chart. be first. Look at this. <laughs> that is awesome. I just jam this in here to break it. Yeah, there we go. Useful statue. What the hell is this? That's a pretty it's cool better. way to defend your bridge with just rotating knives. I pressed a button and then this thing came up. Cool. Oh, the other buttons. Oh, I see. This is a red. If I press red, I have this bridge, and if I press blue, I have that bridge. Gotcha. Too high. Let's get rid of these guys. <laughs> now I bet you can reach it. Oh crap, we broke it. That's alright, you need some chain anyway. You're one step ahead of me. As per usual. <laughs> Don't believe her. Usually it's it's she's not ahead of me. <laughs> this does burst into flames. Sometimes I go so far around that I'm just about ready to lap you, and for that moment, it seems like I'm behind you. Fishbone. Right, yeah. Sword. Here. Mm -hmm. Rope. Mm -hmm. Diadem. It's this? right in the center of that um, gold this? pot of gold. Is this? Mm -hmm. It's not this. This isn't a diadem. It's not. Pistol. Yeah. Bowl. Uh, up and to the right. Yeah. That was a megaphone. A dictaphone. That thing you were looking at as the diadem might be the lion piece. Star. Starfish. Mask. A ship, just in general. Wow, that was the fastest hidden object game. There's a little clock icon here, so yeah. Uh,
There's definitely a part that said something was too high for us. Oh yeah. Good thing you're here to remember this stuff for me. Really? That's not it? I thought it was so obviously that. So where else could line pieces go? I guess right there. Rag. Oh. It looks like that sand should hold something. Red color. If there was more light, I could see. The, oh, probably put a mirror here so it shines that way. Gotcha. This is kind of reflective. Plate, close yeah. enough. This man's holding a spear in his hand. That might be a clue. This pot contains tar. I could use it to make a torch. This pillar is beautiful. I, mean, I see this statue before, but I had a different pose. Maybe we could go back and look at that man who had the spear in his hand. Wait, what? Wait, yeah, grab that thing. What I want to see is what are the movable parts. So it's hand, head, other hand. Okay. Ah, come on. So looking left, and his hand is just kind of to the side, I guess. King's Chamber. I am King Amadon. Forgive me for not greeting you properly, but my soul is bonded to this spot. This is my punishment to regret my mistakes every day for all of eternity. However, my existence was not always so bleak. Once, I had a loving family, including my younger siblings, Zarina and Cyrus. But something changed them. I first noticed this when they refused to visit our father in his final hours. After he died, I was just too busy learning to be king. I didn't see what they had become until it was too late. But don't let me waste your time reliving the past. Too late. If my faithful servant needs his amulet, please find it and give it to him. I don't, I didn't need him to tell me that. I think maybe we should stop it here. Okay. So thank you everybody for tuning in. We'll probably continue next week. Yeah. Probably. Uh, same time. 8 p.m. in Seattle time, Pacific time. Whatever time that might be for you guys. Now I will try to find someone to raid. Let me see here. Well, looks like it's going to be Nick Capricorn again. He is playing Dragon Warrior. I believe he's playing it blind, meaning he doesn't know where all the secrets are, or how to beat the game, how what all the solutions to the puzzles are. Dragon Warrior, it's one of those old school, traditional JRPGs. It's a good way to relax, wind down after, uh, after puzzling through these uh, hidden object games. Thanks for tuning in everybody, and I'll catch you guys next time.